celebrate these kids. Great night. Good evening. My name is Nate Dennis and I'm the principal at Frank Church and I would like to welcome you all to the Frank Church High School 2022 Spring Commencement. Tonight we gather to celebrate the culmination of each of these graduates' hard work and determination, as well as all of you that have been cheering them throughout the years, and as you can see, there were a lot of you, so good on all of you. Before we begin, I would like to introduce a few of the members of the school board, central administration, and the Frank Church staff. I would like to introduce assistant principal, Mrs. Faith Reeder. Assistant Principal, Mrs. Erin Cabina. <laughs> Assistant Principal, Mrs. Nancy Gersack. <laughs> Counselor, Mrs. Jenny Hansen. <laughs> Counselor, Mrs. Anne Marie Weibel. <laughs> and Counselor, Mrs. Katie Omersovic. such a dedicated board of trustees and district, district administration that consistently support us as we execute our vision of preparing our students for college, career, and citizenship. I would also like to recognize the staff of Frank Church High School. These are people who go above and beyond giving their all to help our students on a daily basis. They are caring and compassionate individuals who consistently address the needs of the whole student. Their impact with our students extends far beyond classroom instruction. Our staff is composed of an amazing group of educators and I couldn't be more proud to work alongside them. Frank Church staff members, would you please, in your various areas, step forward and take a big round of applause. and today we get to recognize and celebrate their monumental display of perseverance. Last year, we recognized at graduation that seniors experienced a number of firsts. Numerous first days, whether it was virtual learning and building learning, those experiences were difficult, but I also think it is fair to recognize that this graduating class showed grit and determination by prioritizing their education by getting up every day to attend schools after two years of sporadic in-building in learning. I think our staff and every staff in America knows how hard it is just to come back from summer vacation. <laughs> These students did it after two years. Incredible achievement. Good for every single one of you. This year has been filled with adversity and challenge, and yet we are here to, today to acknowledge and celebrate each one of your achievements. Some of our graduates have participated in the professional technical programs offered at DTEC and have made themselves instantly employable with job-ready skills. Some of our graduates in our AVID program where they have been given the opportunity to earn college credit from the College of Western Idaho while simultaneously earning high school credit. This class, the class of 22, represents Frank Church's highest percentage of graduates of only almost 70% that are planning on attending a two to four year college. Forty of our graduates will be attending two to four year college Eight of our graduates are enrolled in a trade tech program or cosmetology school, and one of our students will be enlisting in the National Guard. Another big round of applause, please. <laughs> we 
We also continue to reshape the Frank Church community that promotes resilience and perseverance by continu continuing our work in the con community resiliency model. It provided staff and students the ability to self-regulate our nervous system to keep us in our optimal zone to learn. Even in the midst of incredible community loss, we focused on the skills needed to thrive during life's adversities. Each one of you will walk across the stage shortly and should do so with pride. This year has pre pre prepared you for whatever obstacle lands in your way. You have all shown that you are able to persevere and achieve each and every goal you set. Students, I speak for the entire Frank Church staff when I tell you how proud we are of your achievements and how excited we are to see your accomplishments after high school. I would encourage you to keep persevering and continue to be resilient. Would the audience please join me in congratulating the Frank Church High School Class of 2022. And I believe this is, what, this is a strong factor of what makes our school so remarkable. I remember no matter what was going on in my personal life, coming to school helped me feel happy because people went out of their way to help me. I remember having some particularly rough days and being emotional at school, and then I was instantly surrounded by loving and supportive people who cared enough to, not stop, to stop and not only reassure me that everything's going to be okay, but also provide proactive and helpful suggestions to aid the situation. The staff of Frank Church will forever be one of my largest support systems, and for that I am forever grateful. Tonight is an exceptionally important night for everybody here. Parents are watching their babies finish high school, teachers and administrators are watching their devotion and hard work pay off, and we as graduates are experiencing entirely new beginnings. Some of us feel relieved because we have achieved an important goal that at times felt unattainable. For others, it may be a celebration of a new beginning, for example, going on to college, a new job, or the military. But no matter what your personal plans might be, I know the people beside me tonight have what it takes to make the most of future opportunities. Tonight's graduation isn't only to signify that you're receiving this diploma. It's also to take time to recognize how far you've come. As a student of an alternative high school, you've taken the road less traveled. Many of you have faced situations that many adults can't comprehend. But in the end, you have been able to face your challenges and achieve this goal. Continue to strive for greatness. Rise above the expectations placed upon you, and don't doubt yourselves. There are great amounts of talent and brilliance in each and every one of you. And I can't wait to see what well-deserved opportunities come your way. Congratulations, class of 2022. Be proud of yourself and where you're standing this evening. We made it. Good evening. I'm Erin Cabina, and I am honored to be the one who gets to present the two 
winners of the David George Turnaround Memorial Award this evening. Our first winner began attending Frank Church High School as a freshman in 2019. She was a shy and timid student who did not exactly exude confidence when it came to school. As she slowly made connections with our staff members, she opened up about many struggles she had faced in her life, such as family dissension, peer conflicts in middle school, moving and beginning a new high school in a new state, and many other things. During her last two years here at Frank Church, she has blossomed into an amazing young woman. The staff and students are better for knowing her, and she has big plans for her future. She hopes to pursue a degree in social work and serve her community, making the world a better and brighter place. Please join me in congratulating our first David George Turnaround Award winner, Allison Richards. <laughs>
because you are so 